Radio, NPR. So, I've been in Japan for three weeks. I just came back to, uh, to my hometown, um, Baker Bakersfield, California. And, uh, and I decided just to make a, a little video. So, um, I'm, I just went out and I went to, look at that, a Alfonso's Mexican Grill. It's a little restaurant out in front. I'm in my car at the moment, so yeah. So as you can see, it is right there. I came out because I didn't want to videotape in there. And I didn't take my camera with me either. But uh, anyways, anyways. So I bought this. This, this is amazing. This is, I, 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 I told my friend Dylan, that uh, this is what I was going to get when I came back because that's and this is what and it's amazing. Oh my god, I'm in super fries right here, otherwise known as carne asada fries. Oh man, that is just that's delicious. Look, this is my hand. This this thing is huge, hugeness. This is this is a fork, man. Compare this thing is huge. This is full size right here, it's uh, eight bucks. And and I'm going to enjoy that because they did not have the same quality of meat in Japan as, as here. It's like I don't know. I, I just maybe I'm just used to it or something. But I, I thought Japan meat had a lot of fat in it, and it wasn't very you know good. I, I don't know. I just didn't like it. But uh, there you are. And if you're in Bakersfield, California, you need to come to. Alfonso's Mexican Grill on White Lane, and I believe it's Ash or Gosford or something like that. I'll I'll put it up in the comments or something if I if I look it up and uh, and order some super fries or nacho fries. The same thing. One has fries, the other one doesn't has nachos. But uh, yeah, and I'm looking back and forth at the Kimbrin stuff because I'm making sure it's good and zoomed in and stuff. But I'm gonna enjoy this. Look at it again. It's amazing. And I put a lot of toppings on it, so really, you don't, you know, sauces and stuff. Ah. Alright, that's all. Thanks.